Welcome back to the Mars planet, Sol 8, where we travel beyond imagination into the red deserts of mystery and time. In today's episode, we take you deep into the hidden heart of Mars, a world that may once have looked surprisingly like our own. For billions of years, this planet has been waiting silently, covered in crimson dust, holding its secrets beneath ancient rocks and frozen valleys. But now, through the eyes of our rovers and orbiters, Mars is beginning to tell its story, piece by piece, stone by stone. Long before Earth's first civilizations appeared, Mars had its own chapter of creation and destruction. Scientists believe that around four billion years ago, the red planet was blue, covered with rivers, lakes, and even vast oceans. Imagine standing there under a dim orange sun where waves gently touched the shores and the wind carried whispers of life. Volcanic mountains breathed fire into the skies and valleys ran with liquid water. The evidence still remains. Dried riverbeds, mineral veins shaped by water, and rocks that hold traces of ancient clay. As we explore with the Mars planet, we follow the footsteps of legendary missions from the Viking landers of the 1970s to today's high-tech explorers like Curiosity, Perseverance, and the tiny helicopter Ingenuity. Each rover has become our robotic ambassador, capturing the beauty and mystery of this alien world. Through their cameras, we've seen landscapes that look like deserts on Earth, cliffs that resemble Grand Canyon formations, and rock structures so symmetrical they almost appear carved. Some even look like fossils, as if Mars once hosted life, only to lose it in time's relentless march. But what happened to that promising world? Why did the rivers vanish and the sky grow thin and cold? Scientists think Mars once had a magnetic field like Earth's, shielding it from deadly solar radiation. But when that field collapsed, the solar winds stripped away its atmosphere. The blue skies turned pink, the oceans evaporated, and Mars slowly transformed into a frozen wasteland. But even in this desolation, the planet still breathes. Its winds move dunes across the surface, and its seasons bring thin layers of frost and dust storms that can wrap the entire planet for months. Mars is not dead, it is sleeping. Through the work of NASA, ESA, and global space agencies, we now know that Mars still has underground ice, hidden lakes of salty water beneath its polar caps, and mysterious methane bursts that appear and vanish. Could this be the breath of microbial life beneath the surface, or is it just chemistry playing tricks on us? Every discovery raises new questions, and every image makes the mystery deeper. As we continue our journey, let's visit some of Mars's most iconic landmarks. Olympus Mons, a volcano three times taller than Mount Everest, rises like a giant sentinel. Its slopes stretch across 600 kilometers. If it stood on Earth, it would cover the entire state of Arizona. Then there's Valles Marineris, a canyon system so vast that it could stretch across the entire United States. Imagine looking down into those chasms, walls of stone colored red, orange and gold, glowing in the soft light of a fading sun. The shadows of those canyons hold history older than any human memory. But Mars isn't only a place of science. It's a symbol of human curiosity. Since ancient times, people have looked up at the red star in the night sky and imagined it as a world of gods, war, and mystery. Today, we look at it with rockets and rovers, but the wonder is still the same. 
the dream of setting foot on Mars has become one of humanity's greatest goals. Projects like SpaceX's Starship and NASA's Artemis program are building the path to make that dream real. Within the next decades, humans may finally walk on this ancient soil, the first step into becoming a multi-planet species. Imagine that moment, a human standing under the dusty pink sky of Mars, watching the Earth as a small blue dot on the horizon. Every discovery, every mission, and every image from the Mars planet brings us closer to that day. But exploration is not just about going there. It's about understanding what this planet can teach us. Mars is a mirror reflecting our own destiny. If it once had water, warmth, and life, and lost it all, what warning does it hold for Earth? Climate change, atmosphere loss, extinction, all are lessons written in the red dust of Mars. As we zoom in to the latest discoveries, we see stones shaped like coral, layers of sediment that look like the bottom of ancient lakes, and chemical traces of carbon compounds, the very basic building blocks of life. Each rover drill and spectrometer reading tells us that Mars once had life in its own way. Beneath its frozen crust might lie microbes waiting for warmth, or fossils that could change our understanding of biology forever. That is why the Mars planet continues to follow every mission, every new image, and every mystery uncovered. In the near future, new explorers will arrive, robotic and human. Bases will be built near the equator, solar panels will harvest the dim sunlight, and greenhouses will grow the first plants on another world. The sky will glow orange at dawn, and human voices will echo across the plains of Elysium Planitia. What began as robotic footprints will turn into colonies of hope. Mars will no longer just be a red dot in the sky. It will be our second home. But before that day comes, the journey continues. There are still questions buried under layers of dust. Who carved the strange patterns we see in rocks? Why do some formations resemble faces or statues? Could nature alone create such shapes? Or are we witnessing the echoes of a forgotten civilization? The answers may still be millions of years away, but the curiosity burns brighter than ever. Here on the Mars planet, we don't just explore facts, we explore wonder. Every grain of sand, every whisper of wind, Every captured sound of Martian storms reminds us that the universe is alive with stories waiting to be told. The more we learn about Mars, the more we learn about ourselves, our origins, our future, and our endless desire to explore. So stay with us, fellow explorers, because this is not just science. It's the story of life, death, and rebirth written in the dust of another world. This is Mars, a place of silence, beauty, and mystery. And this is the Mars planet, where the red planet speaks and we listen. <laughs>